okay we was able to uh, load the data okay let's just run again we was able to load the data and was able to uh, search the data and this time I'm going to uh, continue with some like um, update and delete so we was able to let's say uh, load the data and uh, right now what I'm gonna do is if you click on this one if you click on this one um, it's going to uh, show some pop-up um, and uh, that's what we need to learn about jQuery mobile pop-up and that in that pop-up we're gonna have some menu for um, uh, updating or deleting but let's just uh, uh, learn about jQuery mobile pop-up first so that one is in the uh, load page okay it's in the load page from the load page what we're gonna do is we're going to um, right at the yep this one is the list item right after the list item what we up not inside it outside of the list item we will define um, the if data row let me just close this to data row equal to uh, pop up pop up probably something that is gonna pop out okay and that pop up we're gonna uh, be able to define the uh, div data row equal to a header and I'm gonna give h1 let's say this one is update delete menu okay then we're gonna make a t for the uh, data role which is the main uh, class is UI content to give some padding inside here you're gonna put some update delete menu that we're gonna code later on okay that we're gonna code later on then uh, the footer div okay data role equal to footer uh, I think for this dialog system to make it simple we are not gonna make any footer so let me just try to uh, cook this one directly so we're going to uh, we are going to um, just try this one first by uh, placing a button here a extract equal to uh, gonna keep an ID so ID equal to uh, pop up uh, update delete so href equal to pop up update delete okay um, uh, uh, data rel is pop up the data relations is uh, data relations is pop up and we're gonna put here pop up and I'm gonna say this one is uh, class equal to UI button so we're gonna have this button if you click in this button it's gonna pop up this one okay it's gonna pop up that one so let's just try and run and see if it works or not okay so this one is what it is for a pop up so let's just see if you go to load page and you have a button click on it it's pop up yeah okay it's pop up the menu without having any contents over here okay and if you touch outside it's gonna dismiss it okay so uh, a silver thing to improve let's say we're gonna put some uh, update delete menu just to have some text over there secondly I can see some okay let's um, okay let's just try it first click pop up mm. now it's, it's, it's the new one not that one so you click on pop up now you have the uh, 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 pop up with the update delete menus okay update delete menu over here okay so so uh, or or is this update delete menu looks like uh, uh, let's put it's like options options okay then inside there we're gonna be able to do some um, update and delete and um, for that pop up if you click outside then it's going to be dismissed but then I'm going to do something like displaying a, an uh, icon here for you to close it so let's just, just do this displaying icons here on the right so um, a 
uh, class equal to UI button, uh, UI icon uh, 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 delete. This one is across, so that you're gonna uh, be able to close it. Then um, UI uh, button icon no text. Then we're gonna give some corners there. UI corner or uh, you may give some shadow, but then let's just is not gonna give any shadow over there. And one special thing is I'm gonna give data rel equal to back. Okay, data data relationship is to go back. Okay, this data rel equal to go back. Okay, so it's going to go uh, backward. Okay, so it's going to go backward and, and actually close this one. Okay, let's just run it. Okay. Okay, finish running. Let's just go. So look at this one, load page. If you click on, wow, there must be some arrows over here. Okay, there must be some arrows over here. So the arrows is the one that I have to tell you. Okay, it is actually the arrow over here. Okay, so I have to end the anchor over here. So let's just try to find it again. Yeah, so click on this, click on this, click on the pop up. Yeah, you have the close button. Okay, you have the close button. You have the close button. Yep. Okay. The next thing is, um, I'm gonna cook the um, update and the delete methods over here. Uh, so that one we're gonna cook to two. A, uh, nothing. So, uh, class. Oops. Start. Class equal to UI button. UI icon. Delete. Okay. UI button, um, icon left, and we're gonna say this one is uh, delete. Uh, I'm going to put another one, a class equal to UI button, UI icon, uh, 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 update, so edit. So if, if you don't remember the list of icons, just go to the website. So go to, let me see this one. So you go to the sections of the icons and at the end there will be, at the end there will be a reference for you to get a list of all the icons there, okay? So now we'll get back to this one, um, UI button icon left. And this one is about update. Let's, let's just run this one. Try again. So click on this one, click on this one, pop up. Uh, this one, you have the menu with the two lines. Uh, it's, it's, it's up to you, but then I think I'm just gonna make uh, the um, UI button inline. So we're gonna have them separate this way, not at all. Uh, top down. So we are going to say UI uh, button in line. This one as well. Okay, UI button in line. So it's gonna go in line. Not gonna take the whole line. Okay. And it's not gonna take the whole line. Okay. Let's let's see. Click on this, click on this, click on this. Yeah, okay. So you have the menu for uh, update and delete already, and you can close them. Later on, we're gonna code some actions to delete and update correspondingly, okay, correspondingly. However, the next thing that we would like to do is uh, we don't want to uh, delete and update or maybe we'll do it later. Actually, what we want is when we click on this one, it's pop that one out, not 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 click on this pop up. But this one is just to demonstrate about the pop up. So we'll do that one later. Okay. 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 Let's just 
Okay. But then um, point that I'm I'm gonna do that uh, pop up instead of this button right now. So what we're gonna do is okay. Uh, we'll just pop it up later then. 